did you know that you can create message boxes and hook up patch cords with the circular menu? Here's how you do it. Let's have a look at some more features of the circular menu in Mac 6. One of the things I can never remember when programming in Max is what all the various inlets or outlets of objects do. Let's take a look at an object like MIDI format. I want to send a control change message into the MIDI format object, but I can't remember the inlet for control change messages. So now I can go to the circular menu and click on the connect segment. This gives me a list of the descriptions of the inlets and outlets of the object that the circular menu is attached to. There it is, control change. Inlet three. You can see the red circle is around the inlet there. Now I can click on this and I get a patch cord attached to inlet three, which I can hook up to my message. Exactly the same thing also works for the outlets of objects. Now let's look at the Messages segment of the circular menu. Here I have a circular menu attached to a buffer object. I can't remember what the message is for changing the size of the buffer in samples. I can click on this Messages segment and there they all are. There's all of the messages that the buffer object receives. There it is, Size and Samps. Now I can click on that and I get a message box which is already formatted in exactly the way the buffer object accepts the size and samples message. Happy patching!